Good morning, students. Welcome back. In this session, we are practicing email writing. Email writing is very important nowadays in all offices, wherever you are working. You have to use email writing as one of the best kind of uh, communication skill. It is a writing communication. It's one of the effective writing skills in English language. And moreover, you have to write emails in the offices where you are working. You are working in an office. You are placing order for some items. For example, there is a supplier company of mobile phones. You are working in a mobile shop or you own a shop. You want to place order for 100 mobiles. Then how do you place order for that? This is how you have to learn or you have to work on behalf of your boss or the manager. Your manager or the boss or the office in charge may ask you, you have to give mail to the supplier company. We have placed order for 100 mobiles. You place, give an email, send them a mail. He may ask you, then you are required to give email. How do you practice? You all know that you can give mails through the mobiles also, through the laptops or PCs, computers. In whatever mode you select, the procedure is same. And before going into the procedure of mail, first we have to learn some steps. What are those steps? You should have one mail ID or your office should have one mail ID. No, the mail ID of the supplier company in the present case. They are supplying the mobile phones in our present situation. Then you have to give the content part. That means you have to compose the mail. You have to compose the content. How shall you do it? That is what we are going to learn here. And this is the email page. In this email page, we are coming to compose button. In that compose button, you have to first see where you have to the slot. Find the slot where you have to give your mail id mail from and to mail ids you should know and you should be clear about here to here i am selecting one mail id that is my own personal mail id because uh, this is a model email so that i am adding my personal mail id in case you want to uh, add or attach this letter or quote this letter to any other sections of your office then you have to add another mail also another mail id also i am choosing another mail id okay here subject is there and what is the subject in subject you have to um, add your content in brief for example purchase of purchase of mobile phones okay purchase of mobile phones. This much is sufficient. If you want to extend further, you can give also. And now I would like to uh, discuss on the content. Look students, I prepared this content because it will take uh, additional time in this tutorial so that first we, we will decide on two mail id, then subject purchase of 100 mobile phones. Suppose this order uh, dates 21st May 24 like that. You can add some date also and uh, content. So here you have to discuss and uh, decide on the content. You have to discuss with your office people. You already paid them advance of 50,000 rupees for 100 mobile phones so that you are waiting for the order to receive. This is what you want to inform them. You are expecting an earliest order from them. So we inform you that we paid 50,000 rupees advance for the supply of 100 mobile phones. You can also uh, use alternative sentences. We already paid you sir 50,000 rupees as advance or we inform you that we paid 50,000 rupees as advance. 
and please supply us mobile phones as early as possible here we you also can inform we request you to please supply the mobile phones as early as possible and uh, uh, we are expecting the order from you within two weeks or else you can write please see that the purchase order will reach us by the end of this month or within two weeks like that we will pay you the remaining balance after we receive the mobile phones from you yours sincerely abc mobiles shop ramnagar this is an imaginary address this is how i uh, uh, why i have uh, added this uh, a part of this word document the reason is that you uh, you have to be very clear about your mail id to mail id and uh, the subject and you have to discuss the content part with the members of your office and you have to decide on that your sentences also should be in simple sentences we have discussed alternative sentences also this is how here we, uh, we are selecting this part content part and we are, we are copying it and we are minimizing this screen and coming back to we are coming back to mobile um this one we are coming back to mail page here we are pasting that content we are pasting that as it is uh, taking see here we pasted it instead of that you can directly type also here instead of typing why what i advise you is you prepare a word document in detail by discussing with other members of your office also and then you please uh, come to this mail page and then they, there you copy and paste it then that will be very fine then there will not be any doubt for you and corrections also will be very very less so my dear student let us meet in the next session i request you to please subscribe my channel and leave your valuable comments and give a like and please share this video tutorial about email writing thank you thank you all